All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to One Game One Life. My name is Typo, and this is Fallout 3, Part 77. And we're still keeping Elliot alive so far. Um, so something I noticed is we are gaining a lot of experience here. I think there's almost no chance we don't hit level 30 while we're on the alien ship. So that's about where we're at. I'm pretty sure level 30 is on its way. Maybe not this episode necessarily, but... Um, definitely while we're on the ship. This is just going to unleash the super mutants, isn't it? Let's not do that. <laughs> Let's not do that. Uh, are there any that we do want to release, though? Probably not. Oh, what? Oh, we missed an alien. I did not expect that. Wipe him out, then. Nice miss. Our death claw gauntlet is in awful condition. Just awful. That is that is not that is not good. Let's go ahead and pop this. Boom. Elliot looks like he's, you know, mostly healthy. I probably should have gotten him involved in that. Okay. We're seven pounds over now. Whoa. How do we do that? How are we seven pounds over? What did we do? Oh, the spacesuit and the Tesla helmet. That's right. That's right. Let's repair and drop the Tesla helmet. I guess we don't need that. Charisma minus one, rad resist plus, plus five. It's nothing special. Let's drop it blind. Uh, what what does the other side have before we leave? Uh, I don't think there's anything. Oh no, it's right here. Here it is. They are. I think it's just, yeah, it's just more super mutants. Nope, we're good. <laughs> no need to make it harder than it already is. So that's the generator. Now, how the heck do we destroy it? Okay. Uh, I think I know how, Elliot. Sally already ran us through the tutorial on this one. Okay, here we go. Let's go, Elliot. Run! Elliot! Get away from it. Should be going any second now. I guess we had a lot of more time than I thought. Here we go. All set. Destroy the generator. We did it. Is this our teleport? Yeah. Hey there. What'd you need? Okay, gotta go. All right, let's head back. What do you think, Elliot? That went well? What's on your mind? I guess so. Here's some Adapt Visor, please. Oh, we already did. Okay. Alright. Looks like we're set on this. Cryo facilities taken care of. Oh, wait. No, this is back to this part. Okay. We still gotta leave, leave. Alright. But this side of the ship should be safe for everybody else. We've cut off that side. So they're not coming from there. We can fall back on this area if we need to. What is this? This was closed, wasn't it? Pretty sure it was. Epoxy. Biogel epoxy. Nice. Getting a lot of loot here. Not bad at all. I don't know what that switch does. Hey, Sally. I knew it. I knew it. Yeah? Lights went out for a few seconds, and I just knew you took out one of those generators. All you have to do is two more, and we can leave. Okay. You know anything helpful about the other sections of the ship? It's a pretty big place, and I've only seen some of it. They always catch me before I see the whole thing. <laughs> I've seen the cryo lab. That's where they freeze people and cut them up and stuff. Whoa. And the hangar. That has the aliens' flying ships and all the stuff they need to fly them. And the robot assembly is where they build the big metal robots they use. Mm -hmm. The real important 
stuff is on the top of the ship. I've never been there. Okay. All right. Got to go. Oh, no. ah, got to go. Don't worry. I'll be safe with these guys. They seem pretty neat. They seem pretty neat. You're fun, Sally. <laughs> I'm glad Sally's having a good time. All right. We got a couple more areas to go explore, I suppose. The hangar's right here. Pretty sure Cowboy Man wanted to come with us for that. Elliot's still following us? What is all this? Generator down and two to go. Nice work taking out the generator. Only two more to go. Yeah, all right. Yeah, yeah. Just don't think about ditching me. We're in this together. You say that, but you won't repair my stuff, so... Eh, maybe. All right. So this is where we're posting up, huh? Decompression chamber. Yeah, we got one. Interesting. Bottle can't mind. Hell yeah. Paulson? You can pat yourself on the back when you've blown up all the generators. Not just one of them. Well, what a cheery guy. Gotta go. So, wait. I'm not taking... You're doing great. Only two more generators and we can move on. Just hang in there. I know this is rough. Okay. Do you make use of that stuff you picked up in the cryolabs? Yeah, I think so. Before I was shipped out to Anchorage, I was trained in cryoscience. We were hoping to apply that to medicine. Oh, okay. The compounds we used weren't that different from this cryogenic liquid. Pretty sure I can make us some improvised weapons from Yo, it. Yo, he's mad I'm smart. Something along the lines of cryo grenades and cryo mines. I don't know yet. Check back with me in about an hour and I'll see what I can do. Yo. He's the reason he made that we have cryo grenades and cryo mines. I hope that's the real. I hope that's the real reason that exists in Fallout 4. I think you should remain in the engineering corps for now. Okay, whatever you think is best. Okay. Check back with them an hour. Paulson, yeah. ready for the hangar? My God, I hit my mic there. Extra gun in the hangar bay. Can you lend a hand? Well, now you're speaking my language. Hell yeah, I'll come with you. All right, let's do this. Fine, I'll be. No, you'll be coming with me. Here we go. Hangar time. Container as soon as we come in. How nice of them. Alright, Paulson. I noticed none of you sneak. What's that all about? Whoa, this looks crazy. Oh, that's the ship we found on the ground earlier, basically. That's awesome looking. This is really cool. How do I not remember this? I've played this DLC when I was a kid, but... God, my memory is so bad. How do I forget something like that? That's so good looking. There's a lot of really cool stuff going on. Why are there no aliens here? Did we already check this container? I don't think we did. No, we didn't. Okay. Anything here? Anything here? No? Okay. Uh, activate drone pod? That's a drone control device. Okay. Whoa. I don't know what those tall, shiny things are, but I'd stay away from them if I was you. Okay. No, I'll take that. I'll take that notice. One game, one life isn't the time to be testing stuff with that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's avoid the tall, shiny things. There's a turret. End of the road for you. No, it's just too high up. Oh, hello. At least Paulson has a gun, so I don't have to worry about hitting him, because he stays back. Let's go, Paulson. Unlike Elliot, who tried to put himself in melee range over and over. A lot of stuff closed off that I want access to. 
Thank you. This death claw gauntlet's just about spent. Let's get Eugene out. We're gonna have to use him out of necessity just because we don't have another death claw gauntlet or anything like that. We could use our fists, I suppose. Just bare knuckle it. We have important looking gizmos up there. That's gotta be where the generator machine is. Yeah. Make sure I'm not getting too close to this stuff. Oh shit. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Yeah, hold up, we're gonna have to bare knuckle it. That's right, this that alien's not very strong. We can kill this one, no problem. Paralyzing palms all around. Let's go. Dude, our damage is not the same without the death plug on it. But we can still make it work with paralyzing palms. Keep it going. Keep it going. Man, do I miss that death claw gauntlet. We'll hang on to its durability, though, for one big fight. Um, I'm sure there will be one. At some point, we're going to really want those uh, death claw gauntlet hits. And so, with its condition like that, I want to save it for something big. Uh, is any switches here? No? Here's a switch. Anything? No, not looking like it. I know there's a guy up here. I saw him in the distance. I think that's the one I saw, actually. Don't let him do whatever he was about to do. Paralyzing Palm, get him. Let's go. Is this to control all the doors? There he goes. It makes sense though that we would hit level 30 in this situation. I mean, it's wild what's happening. Holy hell. Those towers made out of lightning or something? <laughs> come on, come on. You're going to play with those buttons all day. We need to keep moving. <laughs> I did like playing with the buttons, though. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I didn't think I'd made enemies like that. Okay. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay, I see how it's gonna work. Damn, one got by. Okay, there you go, flying, whoa. Go ahead, Paulson. You got this. The hell if we're dying up here. Take him. Keep hitting those buttons and take him down when you can. I'm, I'm getting him. I'm getting him. Promise, I'm doing all I can. Paulson, you good? Maybe. Oh God, I'm losing a lot. Paulson. We're gonna lose Paulson, aren't we? Please don't tell me I lost Paulson. Hello? Where are you? Where's Paulson at? Where's my guy? Is 
This is a lot of enemies. This is a lot of enemies. How is this not over yet? How is this not over? What am I supposed to do? To end this? Understand. What am I supposed to do to stop them from coming? Paulson, you're alive! Speak your piece. Oh my god, I thought I lost you. Think anything in here could prove useful? The only thing useful in here is me and my gun. Now let's keep moving. <laughs> okay. Suit yourself. How do they keep coming? When does that stop? Damn. Did we do it yet? Looks like they're finally more or less done. They're still coming? Come on. Okay. I can't believe there's more. Paulson, you better not die. I swear to God. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. How many of these things are there? That's what I'm saying. There's way too many. Hang in there, Paulson. Yo, what is this number? Heads up, more aliens coming in. This is way too many. That's finally it. Oh my god. The hell if we're dying up here. Take that was out. absurd. Oh. oh my god. Paulson? We did it. We won, Paulson. Yikes, that was rough. Oh my god. That was insane. The sheer amount of aliens that kept coming and kept coming. That's wild. I had no idea we'd ever meet a number like that. That is so wild. Drone cannon. A Pipos error 26. Hell yeah, I'll take that. <laughs> what is what is this? One of oh, it's a big gun. Whoa. Oh my. Are you serious? How fast does it shoot? Not super fast. That's really cool though. We gotta make space. We gotta make space for that. We can just stop pop stop. Blah, blah, blah. Start popping buff outs again, I think. That is really cool. What the Okay. These these are open now, right? Alright, hold up now. I gotta I gotta keep that drone cannon out. That's really cool. Alien power modules! Nice. And a container. More power modules. Oh, I almost didn't take the e epoxy. What a really cool... It's a big gun. It's a gun-like type we actually use. A lot of crystals. Pretty cool that they have a... Uh, 
The only weapon for us. Careful. Careful. Yeah, you know what? I'm not even gonna go out there for that. That's not worth. It. That's not worth it. We went through this, right? Yeah, we're all we're all covered. All right, let's go ahead and get back up there. I'm sure a bunch of aliens despawned because there was too many bodies. Fair enough, I guess. Whoo! The hangar, huh? <laughs> that was so many enemies. That was wild. I don't even know what else to say. I've said wild too many times this episode, but come on. It was. A lot of them got through. That was almost bad. Okay. Let's get out of here. Here's this. All the stuff. Well, you didn't like our little journey? Cowboy? Weren't a fan, huh? Alright, one left then after this. Here we go. Let's go, Paulson. Run! There we go. We'll be fine. Out here's plenty far. Scratch one generator machine. That ought to piss those aliens off. If we're done, Hell yeah, Paulson. We should get back to the others. Let's do it. Making really good progress, actually. Is this not the teleporter? I guess we don't need a teleporter, right? The, the door was right over there. Huh. Okay. Sure. Let's go back then. With a new heavy weapon. <laughs> it's not amazing. But it'll be a decent little sidearm, I think, for when we're trying to save ammo, maybe. Hundred and six. It just fires too slowly to be realistically useful in the long run still one generator to blow up figure you should be off doing that instead of hanging around here hanging hanger you should remain in the engineering corps for now if i see any aliens i'll say hello for you thanks paulson i have a feeling we're gonna bring japanese guy into the robotics factory right is that what we're doing is that a thing we do where is he anyway There's a door there. Can we open that now that we cleared it? Cargo hold? I think so. This isn't like a full area, is it? It is. What? Okay. A lot of containers. We dig that. Try a sneak attack, I guess. That didn't hit it, did it? The way it bounces is wild, too. Ugh. There it is. I don't think this is a whole area. I think this is just loot. Teddy bear? That's right, we have a lot of teddy bears, don't we? Probably too many. We don't need this disintegrator. It's cool. We don't need this atomizer either. I mean, it would be responsible to bring these back just for the technology alone, right? Maybe we take one of each alien weapon home with us just for the sake of salvaging, like, preserving technology? It's a lot of teddy bears. 
the collector's hallway. Hammers. Okay. Okay. That's really weird to use. Like, really weird to use. Whoops. Took another drone gun. I guess I guess we can repair with that. It's actually even better, yeah. One thirty one now. It's getting better. All these on on a Lulu dolls or whatever. Uh oh. This is really hard to use. Does it really just, like, not even explode on them? I was gonna say, what? If I hit them with it, it, it can still bounce away from them. That's really questionable. As to whether we'd even want that. Ow. Okay, it looks like it drops when you hit people with it, though. There we go. 133 at basically full repair. We're not gonna take another one. Oh. That's... <laughs> it drops. There it is. Oh, it does damage on impact too, okay. Good to know, good to know. There we go. Okay. Alright. I'm starting to get the hang of this thing. The drone cannon. We've got over a thousand ammo with it too. But let's go ahead and you Hey. Eugene ammo right there. Eugene, right here. Nice repairs. Where? Oh, is he up top here? Bye. Eugene says hello. Yeah, I don't think this actually gets us anywhere. Oh, hell yeah. Nuka-Cola collection. They love it just like we love it. Everybody loves Nuka-Cola. <laughs> They're collectors. Totally understand. Oh, where? There you are. There we go. Our damage resist is so insane. We can just sit there like that. 84%. Love it. We're only taking like a sixth of the damage we should. Read Underwood's terminal? What? Containing. Perfect. <laughs> just like that. Log entry 411-2063. Remote unlock safe? What? They think... They think we're stupid, that we have no idea what they're up to, but we know. Barbed wire, top fences, and security cameras be damned. We'll get the truth to come out if it's the last thing we do. The conspiracy has to end. And we'll be the ones to drag it from the shadows and cast it into the spotlight for all to see. They deny everything. They deny the place even exists. But here we are, faced with armed guards who patrol the dunes and robotic sentries calculating our every move. They're careful, but not careful enough. I found a loophole, a way, and I need to exploit it soon. We are not alone. Okay. What, Area 51? We've done it. We have it in our hands. The smoking gun. The evidence we need to prove that everything they've told the world is a lie. Now let's try to see them weasel their way out of this one and make petty excuses. The only reason they've been so successful this long is because of the lack of proof on our part. Now that's all over. As soon as the coast is clear, we're bringing this thing to the press. But for now, we need to lay low. No telling how long it'll take before they discover how we did it. Okay. They're closing in. How did they find out? What did we miss? I thought we covered our tracks, but there must be some but there must be something we'd forgotten. The security logs were completely erased, the inventory files were rewritten. That only leaves Dr. Morley, that bastard. He approached us saying he wanted to crack the conspiracy wide open, and all the while he was playing us like fools. He just wanted to expose us, to bring us out into the open so they could eliminate us. Well it's not going to work. They'll never find us and they'll never get their hands on the item. The item. Okay. Banks is dead, Combs is dead, I'm the only num member of Quara Virum left. I'm not certain how much longer I'll be safe here. I'm 
placing the item inside a specifically constructed safe with a remote lock trigger. It'll take a damn genius hacker to get into this terminal, and the safe can withstand anything they throw at it. Tomorrow I take the terminal and the safe, where I'm going to bury it out in the desert where they'll never find it. Hopefully, one day, someone else will discover the item and realize that they hold the key to unlocking the truth. All they need to do is succeed where we have failed. Good luck to us all. Okay, sure. I wonder where that safe is. Buried in the desert, he said? Just somewhere? Oh, there's no chance we find that. There's no chance we find that. Cute, but no chance we find that. Oh, hell yeah, more minigun ammo? I mean, all of this is a, essentially, basically, uh, minigun ammo eventually. When we go back to the pit to turn in teddy bears and make some more printing press action happen. I never thought we'd be able to just do all this. What the? Where? There you are. That we'd be able to use the minigun so freely, but now that we can print press ammo, <laughs> I mean, how can we not? Yikes. Addicted to buff out? That's fine, because I plan on being on it for a while. Door to research lab. What? This just keeps going? For real? I didn't think this was going to be all that. I thought it was like a side room with like a reward, basically. Yo, that's a lot of buff out. Nice. That'll last us a while. Nuka-Colas. We'll drink those for healing, I guess. A lot of good right here. Yeah. I like that. Okay. They're weightless. Nuka-Cola. Delicious. And some purified water to hydrate. Perfect. I can't believe there's a research lab here. I really didn't think it was going to be all this. But okay. <laughs> they really like collecting, huh? Okay. What's in the research lab? This feels like a completely unnecessary area for us to be exploring. Oh, there you are. Oh, wow. Look at this guy. Hold up. Probably shouldn't have used the Death Claw Gauntlet because of durability. But look at this guy. Damn. You know what? Actually, maybe we will. There we go. Jesus. It's a pretty tough one. Really, we're hidden? Interesting. I don't know how they didn't hear all that. But okay, we'll take it. Alright, I might have to call this here. We're running out of time, so we'll pick up here, I guess. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, consider giving it a like. And if you really enjoyed it, consider subscribing. Either way, thank you so much for joining Trent and I on this journey. And I will see all of you next time.